fucking time you showed up. I could retire by now. Man, you are a difficult man to find. Perhaps I wanted it to stay that way. Next time you could send me an email instead of sending one of your buddies to my door. <laughs> I'm amazed you still work for the department even after all these years. And as much as I appreciate the ice cream play date, you might as well tell me why I'm well, really- Well, let me tell you. With all the recent murders and missing people, I'm stuck between my department and fighting for myself. I can't, I can't keep telling the city that everything's perfect when it's slowly peeling away. I need your help on this one. So I'm getting ice cream for trying to solve a case. Hey, don't get smart on me, kid. You haven't changed one fucking bit since the last time I met you. However, I'm going to cut you a deal of a lifetime. You solve this case, I'll consider your background and records clean. You'll be a free man. Well, excuse me. I got a city to work on. Why? What the fuck do you think it is? I didn't sign up for this. You trying to get me in even more trouble? I have much of a choice now, do I? You know this stuff more than anyone else. But then again, if it wasn't for your father to teach you all these neat little tricks, he would have been here. Is that right, Mr. Edwards? Or is that part of your collection? Perhaps I should have picked a couple more people before I retired. Perhaps I should rip these files up. And then tomorrow morning, I bust down every damn door and window every cop in town, and we put your ass behind bars for everything you've done in the city. I'm giving you a chance here, Clint. Why don't you, for once, actually put your good skills to use? What's the worst that can happen? That's what I thought. But who knows? Hey, maybe it'll be done in one night. But don't test me for me. I better get called tomorrow morning for everything you gather. that can happen.
Hello? Who is this? I take it you don't want to talk to me. Is this who I think it is? Check this out. It might help your case. This site here just went live, and it's trending on the back channels. I've been monitoring for the past hour, and every so often, a different girl shows up. Oh look, here comes a new girl now. My name is Amelia Lewis. Someone has kidnapped me. I don't know where the fuck I am. It's it's dark and, and freezing. And I think there's blood on the floor. I was on the shadow web. I was just researching something and I found this cult called the the prey I think um, I don't know what happened after that I I just saw these these fucked up images and these men in masks and then I woke up here hello I, I need to hide I need to 
seems Amelia is a reporter, just like you. Interesting. She must have dug a little too deep on the dark web and caught the attention of some very twisted individuals. I just saw someone. I don't know if he saw me, but it's definitely them. He was wearing the same mask. I don't know how the fuck they got to me, but they did. Interrupt your little broadcasting for something even greater for you. Mr. Edwards. Now that's a name I haven't heard in a long time. Oh, how the years have gone by, Clint. However, tonight, I'm gonna make it very clear that tonight will be a true Game changer. I want to do something different for you. You are our special guest tonight, and I'm going to be giving you quite the challenge. And I'm curious if you can still even do it or not. I I've made this game just so much more fascinating. You know, peeling out someone's smooth skin, or maybe even taking a little scalp and checking out their eyes. But tonight, I want to do something different for you. Did you really think that after all these years that you would be safe in your little apartment like that? We've been watching you. And I know all your little secrets. Well, it's been fun chatting with you, but a gentleman like myself has to be prepared for all my clientele that comes through here. <laughs> the site seems to have a cutoff time at 4 a.m. tonight. After that, I'm afraid of what will happen to her. Upon your search, you may come across threats. You'll have to search through websites for specific hashes, which will eventually give you a full code. Unlocking this should reveal the location of where she is being held. I left some documents on your desktop with some more information on that. Good luck. up the stakes.
hiding in the closet. When is he never, am I right, folks? <laughs> oh, soon he will be gone, and I will soon to have my fun. Sir! We have a problem. What are you doing? I'm in the middle of filming! But sir, Pitt has escaped. What?! How is this possible? He's escaped. He went through the back door. Do you have any idea what will happen if I tell our boss there is God? I'm supposed to run this show! God damn it! Useless always. Where, where's that package headed off to? He's headed to the park. We have everything set up. I want you and your buddies to go to that park and just observe. Make sure everything's on track. He already has danger on the way. And give me some drones over the park. Now! Wait! What about Lucas? <sighs> I will make a nice little phone call. Let's make this interesting, shall we?
hire any good people anymore around this city. A serial killer can't even do his job anymore. Oh, good lord, what did he just break into now? I don't have insurance for all of this, Clint! Bringing you Clint. I promise. You have won. I will be bringing this to the masks of deception. They will know of your faults and failures. And I will be waiting behind that musty door, hiding in the shadows, listening to all you do. Do you understand? Yes. Ha, 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 ha. 
Knock, knock, knock. Tick, tick, tick. tick. Hello, Clint. How has your night been so far? I have to admit, it's satisfying to see you face to face. I'm fascinated that you were able to make it your own escape. Adam, what's going on here? Where am I? What did you do? What? What? Are... I think it's pretty. I think it's pretty obvious. Sadly. Your tech skills show much more, much more than your brain, Clint. You know the problem with people these days? They are far too sheltered. Playing make-believe in a utopia that doesn't exist. Hiding behind their computer screens. Or whatever helps distract them from reality. But the truth is, they're an embarrassment. Abandoning human nature for fantasy. They've lost touch with the most essential instinct. Survival of what? The game, Clint. My game. Once faced with life or death, these same people revert back to their primal selves. Pure subconscious volition. That's what inspired me to create all of this, Clint. Profit. Profit made off of the fate of the unsuspecting. So, uh, just another unsuspecting victim like Amelia? Amelia? Oh no. Amelia isn't anything special. But you. I've been watching you very closely, Clint. You gained my interest when you started learning more than you should have. No one had the same inclination as to who was orchestrating all of this. Except you. So why not just kill me then? But, rather than disposing of you, I found it more intriguing to just give you a fighting chance. Devise a game on it. See if you can interpret the rules and abide by them to elude the night. And make your will to live. I have a large clientele that pay very well to view my games. It's growing to a very remarkably lucrative business. A lot of effort to make me fear for my life. Well, that's the only reason. The entirety of your house is embedded with surveillance cameras, along with our trusty drone and building cameras. Every movement you have made tonight, the viewers have been watching you. Every single movement you have made. The adrenaline rush possibly witnessing someone's last moments of life in real time. No acting, no script, just pure, authentic emotion. It's a thing of beauty. So this was all just some sort of sick show? Yes, Clint. But frankly, I'm surprised you even took on such a task. You seemed so eager to push yourself away from your past, yet so eager at the same time to relive it. To solve one more puzzle. Of course, you did miss a couple things. Amelia. Amelia was pivotal in getting you to participate. We knew she was the perfect bait to engage you. The whole time, we thought she was my main priority. Not quite. You were always made it. Was? Is she dead? We'll get to that shortly. I hope you're thinking. You're thinking, what next? Right. We're all thinking it. The viewers are waiting with bated breath to hear your answer. 
how the game ends. Life is a dark undertaking, Clint. In the face of death, one must make inconceivable decisions. There is undoubtedly a humbling virtue to truly experience your own mortality. What the hell do you want from me? I simply want to give you a choice. It's time for you to decide. You can walk out of here a free man, and we will forget any of tonight's events even took place. Cease to investigate any of my games. I've already taken the liberty of uh, having the cameras removed from your house as well, including your computer. It has all the other information on Amelia. Restriction for. You can go home and relax. Love your daily lives. Life you have left in you after tonight. I believe you also have your records wiped clean too, yes? Maybe I can send the records to the man himself. Makes you wonder you know, what you could do with the rest of your life and how you choose to live now, Clint. Surely. Don't you miss all of this? What are you looking for in return? Now you're getting it. If you choose freedom, Amelia, the girl you have been so desperately trying to save, will have to die in your place. What will you do? Do you sacrifice yourself to save an innocent girl? Or will you give in to your pride? Mistakes and choose life. I want to live. She has a game to finish. Survival is a strong force, Clint. Don't feel too bad. Everyone is always looking out for themselves in the end anyway. Get him out of here. That's it. Oh, Clint. Thanks for playing. Must I really explain everything? Uh, and the dead to live. Well, at least I tried to prove that. Say, I just got a lot of time on my hands now. Still needing help? Always open to you, Mr. Edwards. What uh, exactly are you looking for? I have some unfinished business with some people. I have to stay low for now, but... Perhaps you have some place I could work? This is a two-way street, my friend. My work has become especially hard on myself. But with you, I think I can make an arrangement. Let's you make... do the hard part, and I'll do the easy part of it. Let's make it happen, then. What's the worst that could happen to me? Based on tonight's performance, we're just getting started. But I'll leave you to it, sir. No, I am.